What's up everybody, it's Triscota here. Today, it's a special day. I'm gonna be eating McDonald's. It's not random McDonald's. My first time eating McDonald's in six months or half a year. The last time I properly ate McDonald's was at the start of March and I made a video on March 13th of me eating mozzarella sticks, but those aren't really that much McDonald's. Uh, I'm Okay, I know this might be confusing, but I'm just gonna be eating McDonald's, all right? I didn't have it for half a year. Uh, I'm gonna admit I ate few fries on the way. Hmm. And they also say that <laughs> their food is gonna be better now. I don't know how is that possible. The fries are better, I'm gonna admit. There aren't many soggy fries. Okay, I like soggy fries. I don't know what it is. This is how a real man eats um, McDonald's fries. Okay, we won't be only eating McDonald's fries here because that's kind of lame. Oh my god, I always ask for no dip. We're gonna be eating a mac chicken sandwich. And I also got some no traditional chicken nuggets. Just saying, I am able to eat all of this. But I ate some fries before. I, I more than likely won't finish the chicken nuggets. I'll eat them later. But oh, the mac chicken! I'm not really a big mac guy when I go to McDonald's. I'm more for the chicken. Just look how this looks. Okay, maybe we should try the chicken nugget first. This can wait. Okay, usually the chicken chicken nugget has no taste. Tastes like cardboard, but it has a nice texture, a nice crunch. Okay. Hmm, it, it's soggy. <laughs> I, like, I didn't know chicken nuggets can be soggy, but this chicken nugget is soggy. But I like it. Okay, also McDonald's chicken nuggets have few shapes. This is like the American shape or the boot. There's also the circle. There, there's also like a pure rectangle. It's like the boot but without the... As you guys see, there's like a... It's like a rectang rectangle but it has like a... I don't know how to shake all this. Um, the chicken nuggets are a little bit soggy. They do have a complete different taste from what I remember, from my McDonald's at least. Hmm, this chicken nugget isn't crunchy, or isn't soggy, I meant. Okay, we're gonna taste the circle. I think there's only one statement, one theory. Every shape has a different taste. Every single shape because the um, boot or the chicken nugget I call it boot. Let me look for one here. This is more of a rectangle. It's kind of boot, but I'll look for like an obvious, obvious boot. There aren't really many here. Okay, this one's more of a boot. The boots are soggy. Sorry for the trashy lighting. My chicken has my, my chicken. chicken. My kitchen has horrible lighting. The boots taste soggy. The circle, the circle, the circular shape chicken nuggets taste. A little bit better? I'm not sure. I don't really care. Okay, I'm just gonna open up my tango. Oh man, I thought this thing is gonna just... Do you know the days when you try to open the can and this thing just comes off and you're like, what are you meant to do? I nearly had one of those. You guys already saw it before. Oh man. The chicken in the mac chicken sandwich is different from a chicken nugget. It's very similar, but it just has a different taste. Okay. Hmm. Okay, honestly, I just ate half of the burger. Mm, I don't know, like, it's nothing special, really. Because I bet you do not too much mayonnaise. A problem I have with McDonald's, it's like, whenever I ask for a sauce, or where, where, like, whenever there's a sauce in a burger, they won't separate it in the middle, or just, like, put it right in the middle. They'll just, like, put it on the left-hand side of the burger, and the other side has nothing. Legit nothing. I just realized they, there can't be really a left side of the burger, but you know what I mean. I'm not sure if this was worth the hype, to be honest. It's okay. Like, I like it. All we are having is really chicken here. Something special I used to do when I was in 5th class. On the McDonald's receipts, 
they give you like a small coupon. For example, it was a Mac chicken or a Big Mac and a large fries for three ninety. So I was like having that every single day for a while. My mom was getting a little bit pissed, but I don't care. And something special I used to do with the Mac chicken. It's I used to ask for no mayonnaise. I pretty much took out the chicken because the chicken tastes different from the chicken nugget. This chicken inside the burger tastes nothing like the chicken nugget. So I just used to eat it on its own. And I ate the bun and the lettuce <laughs> separately. I like I am a special child, what can I say? Also, when I was ordering everything, it took 10 minutes to order. It's because for some reason they can't just accept, or they like you can't just go up to the cash and ask them for food. You have to buy it on this like you, you know what I mean by those like computers, those touch screen computers. It was slow, and I'm pretty sure that's like less um how should I call it less hygienic. Less there's less hygiene touching like. There will be more hygiene involved if you actually ask the person for the food, other than like touching the thing that everybody touches, kind of sucks. Overall, the whole area changed because like, by the area my McDonald's is located, there's like a lot of bushes around it, or on the side of the path, footpath, and it was just weird to me because like the last time I was at McDonald's was March, and it was pretty cold so there weren't really any plants ar around. Honestly, I forgot that you're meant to apparently like chew something 24 times before swallowing it. I think that's with steak, but I'm not sure. But I'm pretty much just like chewing this like six times and already swallowing it. I'm a real animal. What can I say? I remember I think this was a year ago or two years ago. I did a McDonald's chicken nugget and mukbang. It was meant to be ASMR, but I was talking during it, it's pretty much a mukbang. I remember I ate fries before it. It's because I shouldn't really be doing this. I ordered two packets of fries each time I go to McDonald's. It's because I eat one packet of fries while walking back home. I just can't stand having McDonald's right next to me and not eating it. It's against my beliefs. I just have to have McDonald's if I eat it. It's against my beliefs. I just have to have McDonald's if I eat it. I just have to have McDonald's when I eat it, that would really make sense. I like If I have McDonald's, I just have to eat it, it's not really my choice. Overall, I think the food is a little bit better at my McDonald's anyway. I'm pretty sure the fries are um, fried a little bit better. The chicken nuggets, they, it's like they all share the same taste, but the different shapes taste a little bit different. For example, the boot, or the um, USA or America. That, that's kind of soggy, not gonna lie. Or in my case, it's soggy. The circle is like the perfect one, I think. I'm not really sure. I'm not, really, I'm not even sure if they have different tastes. Maybe it's just my um, brain condition. Honestly, each time I eat a chicken nugget, it's, it's more like eating a, a biscuit, a cookie, or... It's like the texture is so weird. Like, you can barely like feel the chicken inside it, but it tastes very good. Like, do you ever, um, I used to do this weird thing that I used to just like skin the whole chicken nugget out of the batter and just eat that thing on its own and it tasted awful. Or awful compared to like the normal taste of the chicken nugget. This is a weird um, shape, I didn't have it yet. It's like, it's not the circle. It can relate to a circle, but it's not a circle, it's more, more of like an oval. This one tastes more like cardboard. It's like... This one kind of like spreads the taste, that like some areas like taste, have more taste. Like all of these chicken nuggets are pretty much cardboard, but like, so far I ate um, 13 chicken nuggets, um, pretty much a full box of fries and a half, a mac chicken. I'm still gonna eat some of it, but I'm just gonna do it off camera because I don't really have any more topics to talk about on this video. Overall, I'm gonna give this meal 7 out of 10. And this is it. I also have my Tango. I hope Tango sponsored me, sponsors me one day. Use Gotruskota for 100% off to buy a can of Tango at your local store. That's how we could um, end thirst in the world. Well guys, this is it for today's video. Make sure to subscribe and like. And my voice is just off for some apparent reason. Oh, this voice is actually nice. I never really did this voice before, but guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and I'll see you next one. Peace out.